Catholics for Choice shared this on their Instagram page and Twitter as well, saying that abortion providers save lives. And they have this picture. It's a very common image in Canva. I've seen the same one before. It's a very stock usage. But that these people who end little children's lives are really saving life. I think it's interesting when you look at the logo of this organization on the top. What's bigger, Catholic or Choice? It reveals something about their goals, right? We're gonna use Catholicism, we're gonna use religion, and we know that no Catholic would ever say this. We know that the Pope would not say this, at least in their writings and confession, and yet it's more about choice than religion. So what happens when you try to marry political or social movements to religion? One becomes the master and one becomes under the foot. And here's what they have done to Catholicism. We're gonna use a name, we're gonna use a denomination, we're gonna seem like so we can attract more people to it. But really, we're just a social justice movement, and we're willing to say that people who kill other people, well, they're saving lives when literally they're doing the opposite. But if it's about my choice and my selfishness, I will glorify anything, and hope God does too. Psalm 106, praise the Lord. Give thanks to the Lord, for he is good. His love endures forever. When you see horrible things like this posting, you would imagine God sending lightning bolts from heaven. I mean, that's what we deserve. When we take his word and we so corrupt it to selfishly focus on my own goals, God should destroy us right now. But we give thanks to the Lord for our sins, that he has not punished us as we deserve. He has been good to us. His love endures forever. He is patient with us sinners. You can look at something so grossly sinful and say, thank you, Lord, I'm not like that. But that would be pretty pharisaical of you and me too. Instead, when we see others' sins on such great display, calling evil good, let's remember the times I've tried to do that too. Remember the times I've sinned and you have sinned too. And yet God still gives us grace, still gives us mercy, still gives us choice. Not, not in this kind of term choice to get on my knees and confess my sins and say, Lord, I was so dumb. Forgive me. Give thanks to the Lord for he is good. His love endures forever.